Governor Margaret Beasley has officially sworn in Chris Minns as the New South Wales Premier. Prue Carr is Deputy Premier, Premier and a small interim senior ministerial team at Governor House. Kenny Heatley was there for it. Kenny, a momentous occasion, of course, for Chris Minns and this, this small team initially. Yes, what a lovely occasion after a gruelling election campaign. Um, I was speaking with now Roads Minister John Graham after he was sworn in and he said to me that it, it was an overwhelming experience but just so many smiles from the Labor team there. You can tell that they're just absolutely thrilled. Um, but here was the moment when Chris Minns was sworn in as the 47th Premier in New South Wales. I, Christopher John Minns, do swear that I will perform the functions and duties of Premier faithfully and to the best of my ability, so help me God. So a kiss for his wife, Anna, there inside at Governor House. Uh, Governor Margaret Beasley had a few remarks as well. Let's hear those. This morning, and indeed this moment, is a unique moment in your lives. And I'm going to suggest that you savour it. Treasurer, ministers, Attorney General, I don't know whether I've got the in the right order in terms of precedence, but <laughs> congratulations again. It is truly an auspicious occasion. So let's go through the ministers who were sworn in. Prue Carr as Deputy Premier, but also Minister for Education and Early Learning. Penny Sharp, Minister for the Environment, Heritage and Vice President of the Executive Council. John Graham, who I mentioned, Special Minister of State, Minister for Roads, Arts and Minister of Nighttime Economy and Music. Daniel Mookie, the Treasurer and Minister for the Gig Economy. Ryan Park, Minister for Health, Regional Health, Mental Health, uh, Minister for the Illawarra and South Coast. Joe Halen, Minister for Transport and Michael Daly, the Attorney-General. But they're the main portfolios. Each of the ministers sworn in today has many, many other uh, interim portfolios that they are taking on just in the interim. Until the rest of the seats are determined, uh, then in the coming weeks, uh, when other ministers are sworn in, then they'll be divvied up. Uh, but let's hear from Chris Minns, the new Premier, and also the Deputy Premier, Prue Carr, as they said a few words after they were sworn in. It's wonderful to be here at Government House and to be sworn in as the 47th Premier of New South Wales with the interim government now in place. We know there's a huge responsibility on our shoulders and work starts today. Counting is continuing in many key seats and we don't know the final composition of the next parliament. But my team and I are ready to hit the ground running. We know there's a big responsibility and we can't wait for those responsibilities of office. It's been such an honour today to be sworn into the interim ministry. We know that there are seats still yet to be determined, but what we do know is the people of New South Wales sent us a clear message on, uh, on Saturday and they want us to get straight to work on some really important challenges for New South Wales ahead and we're ready for those challenges and to get to work straight away. Ash, a huge moment for them, a huge moment for the state of New South Wales and now the real work begins. Back to you.